when mom brought home this regular and diet. 94.5 FM presents the first annual doubles race to benefit the March of Dimes. The five-mile race will take place Sunday, July 1st at 10 a.m. at the Sheridan Boston. Prizes include a trip to Florida, time of your life weekends at the Boston Sheridan, and gift certificates from Stop and Shop. 94.5 FM will host a post-race party outdoors at the Prudential Center with plenty of great music, Papa Gino's Pizza, Henry's Ice Cream, and Cold Beverages. To enter, stop by your local athlete's foot store, Papa Gino's, Dave McKilvray's Running Center or here at our studios on Stewart Street for a doubles race application. Come out with a partner or by yourself and be matched up with a partner. But don't miss the first annual doubles race, July 1st, because it's part of the best show in Boston, WCLC. I'll tell you, you think you've got a tough? Huh. The only way I'll get to run on a doubles race is if I run cross-eyed. And now that's it. We're extortionists. And we want every last thing you have. <laughs> Wait and we want it right now, don't we, Bone? We want it right now. Yeah. Wait right. a minute here. Now. To, yeah. Now. And not later, either. Right, Boney? You got it, Tony. Hey, wait. Right now. We've been known to tie our victims' heads together and shoot them through the hands. So uh -oh. Uh-oh. 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 uh all right. All right, okay. Well, so All right. we'll call somebody else. Back to the phone. Come on, let's go. <laughs> right. W C O Z C O Z Who's that girl? It's not me. The, the Bandarini brothers did Mandarini. Oh, Mandarini. Oh, hey, wait a minute here. Wipe them out. You wrecked my new Levi's. Uh, Accurate weather forecast is mostly sunny, breezy, and cooler today. 78 to 82 degrees. Are you having a good morning? Very good. Are we doing things okay so far? Perfect. If you had to give... Great. Oh, thank you very much. That's if you were in a, if we were handing out report cards now. Well, I'm just in a good mood because there's low humidity and my hair's like a barometer. <laughs> that sounds like a great country western song. <laughs> And it's low humidity, and my hair's like a barometer. You want to, you want to join in on that? Pardon me? Do you want to join in on that at all, Ann? No, no, that's okay. No, it's, uh, that's great, though. You're tuning a wheelbarrow. <laughs> tuning a wheelbarrow. Never quite heard of it. But like that. 728, we'll check news for you in a couple of more minutes. After Cindy Lauper's time after time, good weather forecast today. Nice and warm, too. A good deal more. 65 degrees here at Copley Place and a beauty today. Sunny and warm temperature into the 80s. Elliot Abrams with a complete COZ AccuWeather forecast in just a couple of minutes. The commute, uh, commute rather, not quite as good. We've got that problem coming in on the expressway. Left-hand express lane, a van with its wheel coming off, and it looks like it's going to be uh, causing problems for the entire commute. The traffic is backed already back beyond East Milton. So uh, Officer Bill, Metro Police Officer Bill Connell, suggests that you might take the local lane, even though it, true is heavy and slow, but you'll move a little bit quicker. It is uh, getting tight on 3 and 128, getting up to the expressway. Everything else looking okay. No major accidents or breakdowns to tell you about. The T reports no major problems. But the second attack on a T bus driver in three days. It happened Monday night. Three drunks assaulting a driver who tried to throw them off his bus in Hyde Park. At last night's union meeting, drivers were told that the T will beef up security on bus runs through Mattapan, Hyde Park, Roxbury. Uniformed guards, canines, more cooperation from Boston police. Nonetheless, there were many reports of buses being stoned again last night. Two people hurt more than ten incidents of bus stonings on Blue Hill Avenue. 